Sup, y'all, bring you guys another video. This bring you guys a uh, quick post fight thoughts video of the fight between Isaac Lowe and Luis Alberto Lopez. They recently fought over in the UK at the York Hall in London. Fight was shown live here in the States on ESPN Plus. You can actually go to ESPN Plus right now and watch the whole entire event. Um, IFL TV showed it, I think, here in YouTube for the UK fight fans. Anyway, fight lasted seven rounds with Luis. Alberto Lopez winning the fight by knockout. Big shot to the body. Round after round, he was just putting on the punishment from the first round, from the first punch actually. Landed the big left hook that dropped Isaac Lowe. That Lowe didn't see it coming. Um, it was more of a flash knockdown because Lowe immediately got up. But still, man, that was the first punch that Lopez drew and he was able to land it clean. In the second round, uh, a big right hand from Lopez landed as well, dropping Isaac Lowe. At that point, Lowe kind of became very aggressive. He started pushing the pace, started pushing the fight, started fighting the inside, started letting his hands go. You know, he was doing pretty well here and there. But he was taking a lot of punishment as well and Lopez was the better inside fighter. And Lopez was still getting to him, landing some good clean shots. But Lowe... The like towards the middle rounds, Low was taking those shots much better, but the punishment kept kept continuing, kept uh, coming, and in the end, it was a body shot that dropped Isaac Low, a uh, big body shot from Lopez. Lopez, um, it was actually a very short body shot towards the end of that seventh round, and Low went down. Referee started counting. Um, he actually got to nine, but. He, the, the ref decided to wave the fight off. Lowe was able to get up, but I can't blame the ref. Lowe was taking a lot of punishment, and Lowe suffers his first loss in his professional career against uh, the Mexican, Luis Alberto Lopez. Viva Mexico, cabrones! <laughs> oh, man. Gotta love it, man. I love, I love the momentum of Lopez right now, pulling off that big win against Gabriel Flores Jr., and now Isaac Lowe, two undefeated fighters, giving them their first L in a row. You gotta give it to him, man. I'm, I'm loving what I'm seeing from Lopez. Definitely deserves a title shot. Um, this was a title eliminator fight for the IBF featherweight title. Um, going to this fight, I think Isaac Lowe was the, the uh, more higher rank fighter. Uh, looking at 126 right now. Um, no, actually. Yeah, I think he is. Yeah. Huh, where is Lopez? Luis Lopez. Interesting. Is Lopez even ranked? I don't think he was ranked, right? But Isaac Lowe was 10 by the, the uh, BBC, 9 by the WBA, 8 by the IBF, and 8 by the WBO. Maybe they need to update this ranking. Um, but now, with this win, Lopez gets to fight for the title, for the IBF title. Um, yeah, they definitely need to update this ranking because Kid Galahad is still the champion in this ranking. It, it, he's no longer the champion. The champion right now is Kiko Martinez. So... Hopefully we see that fight, man. I'd love to see that fight. Kiko Martinez, the veteran, um, you know, pulled off that big win against Kid Galahad. Uh, I would love to see how he'll do against somebody like Lopez, who's young, who's well younger, and uh, you know, loves to let his hands go. Very, who looks very strong and tough and determined. And uh, you know, it, it would definitely make for a great, entertaining fight between uh, Lopez and Kiko Martinez, in my opinion. So, so yeah, man, I was hyped, man. I was like, whoo, Lopez pulled it off. I was worried that. You know, a lot of those rounds, I'm pretty sure a lot of those judges gave it to low. Um, and if it went the distance, oh, especially this guy right here, Howard Foster. That guy, he definitely had low winning. Yes, even with the knockdowns, I'm pretty sure Howard Foster had low winning. Uh, <laughs> anyway, um, good job to Lopez. I mean, give pro props to him for traveling to the UK and giving low his first loss. I mean, it sucks for low, but, um, you know, he got caught early on and... Uh, yeah, the punishment from Lopez was just getting to him. And I, I think it was a matter of time where eventually he would have gotten stopped. But whether it was at the 7th, it would have eventually been... It was going to happen uh, either way. That is in my opinion. Anyway, uh, back to the drawing board for Isaac Lowe. Lopez definitely deserves a title shot. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.